inspire you to do this? Why would, why would you want to do this? I am trying to make my house as energy efficient as possible and to limit my footprint on the planet. So my main goal was to offset the 60% of the energy used in my house um, that is otherwise um, achieved by burning coal by ALP. It's quite an ambitious way to do it, but you've, you're successful here. Well, so far, we're supposed to be averaging 41 kilowatt hours per day, and we're making 64 so far per day. As sun hits the solar panels, they produce DC electricity, and that DC electricity has to be converted into something the house can use, which is AC. And so the inverter panels right behind us there, they convert it into the AC um, energy, and then it goes through wire underground to the uh, meters in back of the house where it's connected and at that point the house will use energy from the solar system first because it comes from the clo closest uh, source and then when they need more they'll get it from the grid or from the utility company as they have before and there will be times potentially that during a month maybe they're on vacation they're not using a lot of electricity and um, they'll produce more than they can consume and that will get pushed back to the electric company and they'll get credits on their bill. Um, and why the Johnsons did it? Primarily, I think, for the environment um, to do their part. They're being good stewards of the land and the lakes around the area um, was the primary driver. And um, certainly it will pay for itself in a number of years. Um, but the, the, the idea of being independent and reducing um, CO2 emissions and such was their, their main driver. Okay, there will be, uh, I mean, this is unique, and, and what are the aspects that makes this unique? Because people have solar, solar panels on their houses, so what makes this different? Well, in their case, their house has many different roof faces, and um, they're all facing many different ways. And unfortunately, there's only a couple that face south, and south is where we want the array to face, if possible. And so they weren't going to reach their goal of their production that they wanted to produce every year um, if they put it on the house. So they had to find another place. And what makes this unique is this is a kind of a narrow stretch of land, but by getting it up on poles, um, we're able to um, get the sun at the highest uh, energy producing times of the day, which is about 9.30 to 2.30 area, somewhere in there. And during that time, it's relatively shade free here. So um, they had to go a little different route because of the amount of panels they wanted and because of the space constraints that they had and they had to get it on poles. So that's why it's different than some of the other sites that you might see. Okay. 